Yeah, well, here we are. This frame, <coughs> painting frame that I was making the other day that I put on YouTube. That is here, I'm just putting a bit of oil in it. I usually use cooking oil, and, uh, and I've used it for years. Um, someone told me years ago not to use cooking oil because it uh, grows underneath the lacquer. It's a load of bullshit. I've been doing it for 30 odd years. And I used the cooking oil because when I painted souvenirs, the timber was dry. I, I could put some cooking oil on here and 10 minutes later I could be painting on it. With the, with the linseed oil, it's a bit different. Um, but it's okay to do this, put a little bit of linseed oil in this, uh, because I'll just sit it out in the sun and it'll, I'm not, I'm not filling every little crack with it though. Um, it'll get sealed with polyurethane or whatever I use to, uh, to do my timber. Um, but, it's got that beautiful, like a leathery sort of quality to it. Believe me, this is old timber. This is two or three hundred year old, I'm guaranteed. And, uh, and I was just lucky to come upon this bit. Uh, there's a little bit left on this one, so I'll have to hunt around see if I can find a bit more of this stuff. Um, but I'm going to, I'll show you it, I'll put the painting in it in a minute. And it's just going to stay dark like that. That's what it'll, uh, once that polyurethane go on, it'll look uh, magic. I'm not even poly set up like that, but... Alright, this is not finished, it needs sealing, but um, I'll put the painting in it and I'll show you, I'll show you what it looks like. on this painting after for this lady and man but uh, there it is when it's finished it'll come up all right I've got a fair bit to do we go back for